Suppose you're in these conditions where there's a lot of wind. And as you can see, I'm not joking. Check this, how much movement's going on. Most of your video will end up being crap because the audio, associated audio, will suck. I'm going to shoot some footage without this microphone, so with the native inbuilt microphone of the camera. And then I'm going to use this microphone so that you can compare the two. So now I'm using the inbuilt microphone of the DJI Osmo Action. I'm far away so you might not hear me. But... We are back with uh, this microphone right here. You can pretty much hear everything. It's 100% wireless, so I can even, I don't know, go up to 80 meters distance. But of course you have to have like direct line of sight. As you can see, a lot of wind, a lot of wind. And I'm going to remove the muff from this microphone and show you how significant, what type of impact these uh, wind noise muffs uh, have on the audio. So let's do it. Okay, you should still hear me quite well, but I'm quite sure it picks up the wind. No wind noise reduction. I removed the filter. Not good, right? Let's put this back on. Good. I'm not just using one wind muff, I'm using two. Uh, you can find the links down in the description. I can't remember the names of them. I think it's just Rykote. It's a Rykote wind muff. If I use the white one, which comes with the package, and additional, another one by Ricotti, I put it right under, then the results are outstanding. So you can see this has a magnetic part on the back and super strong. So you can put it on a backpack, you can put it on a t-shirt, on a shirt, and you don't need to use any adhesive. You don't need to use anything. It's... It also works as a clip right here. And this can go also on a hot shoe mount. But what I really like is I just put this behind and with a magnet, snap it in place. And I can put it close to the subject a little bit further away. And if you happen to have a lavalier, you can plug in the lavalier and talk directly to the lavalier. And an additional thing that I really love of this microphone is that you can connect two transmitters to one receiver, meaning that you can have two people talking at the same time hooked up to the same camera. So the feed of the audio goes directly to the camera. It supports a micro SD card, so you can pop it in and you can hit record. You just have to press the button here. And what it does is it stores audio also on the micro SD. And if the camera fails, it's still recording. Uh, so here you always have a backup. It's, it's good to have a backup plan. It comes with a cover and the cover has like electrical um, uh, parts that touch to these devices and they fit perfectly so that when you close it, it automatically starts charging these devices. So it's just a bigger version. It's the design is a bigger version of this microphone. Of course, they have to be connected to a, a USB Type-C, but it's very clever because it's compact and you can carry it around nice and easy. Uh, it has even a, an area for accessories. It comes with all the necessary cables. Rode Wireless Go would give you only one. But in this case, uh, LensGo gives you two cables, which is really, really sweet. And they give you even a sticker with a piece of metal. It's like, actually, it's a magnet. You can stick it somewhere and then you can easily attach one of the transmitters on it and you can record audio from pretty much anywhere. Like I could put it under this bench. I could leave. When people come, I could overhear anything they say from a distance, which is highly illegal, but very much possible <laughs> with these devices. But the audio that the camera picks up is just perfect. Of course, there's a plus and minus where you can reduce or amplify the decibels. So from plus six all the way to minus six. The LED screen has is rich in information. It's actually really, really good. Um, and it gives you the battery status of both the receiver and the transmitter, the decibel output, what level is the audio coming in? Like, is it distorting? Is it not distorting? And all that type of information. As soon as you switch on the transmitter and the receiver, they immediately couple. So there's really no effort in that. You don't have to press any buttons. It's, it's pretty much instant. It comes in several colors. I believe there should be black. I got the white version and then there's a yellow version. You can plug in a lavalier and you can speak directly to the lavalier, put the lavalier really close to the subject and that will allow you to have really good audio directly from the source only and pretty much filter out all the, the noise and the sound that you don't want. Here, the fluff is a clip-on and it's much better than the Wireless Go because the Wireless Go and the Wireless Go 2, I believe, they clip, but they don't stay in place. 
and they give you two because they already predict that you're going to lose one and I think that's uh, not a really good solution and this beats it 100%. But the biggest selling factor of these devices is that they cost 180 US dollars. Well, the Rode Wireless Go 2 costs about 300, maybe more. I can't remember, but I think it should cost around 300, 350 dollars. And the Rode Wireless Go 1, which is quite old, costs 180 US dollars, which is the same price as this and has half of the features. So I would 100% recommend buying this. It works super well. The only thing that I don't like of this device is that the signal to noise ratio is quite bad. If you don't talk, it's going to start bringing up. It's, it's gonna bring the gain up and uh, all the env environmental sounds around will be recorded because you're just not talking and it's annoying and uh, it just messes up the recording. I would like it to keep those decibels, that amount that I asked. But uh, other than that, I 100% recommend this product. It's fantastic. I think I, mm, I've been using it for like three weeks, but so far I'm using this. I'm not using the Wireless Go anymore. I think I'm gonna sell it. Uh, although I highly recommend that device as well. If you're interested in buying this product, I have the links down in the description. You can check those out. Now I'm in Lindos in Greece. I'm gonna do most of my travel guides using these microphones. So if you wanna know, hear more samples of it, just watch the rest of my videos that I'll be doing soon. Thank you very much Lensco for sending it in. I just wish you would have sent uh, another uh, transmitter. Perhaps get my girlfriend to talk at the same time as I'm talking instead of having to share the same microphone. Anyways, regardless, Thanks a lot for sending in the product. See you next time. Orlando from Greece, ciao. So the price is a little bit steep, 12 euros per person, and customer service is kind of crappy, but this is the best Acropolis around. And if you're not going to Road City in the north, then Lindos is your choice. This is a great place to go to, not only because it's a nice ancient monument, but also because you have a beautiful view of the sea and this beautiful bay shaped as a heart. You can also go there. So you go here sightseeing, you can eat in Lindos, which is the city just nearby, the small town nearby, and Truki, over here. And down there, you see that bay? There's a couple, few umbrellas. It's like an organized beach. And there you can go and enjoy the rest of the day and sunbathe. Water is really pristine and clear, very beautiful. Now we've approached the monastery here in Sambika. And as you can see, this is a temple. Now, if you want to go inside, you'll have to wear decent clothes, and I'm not decent enough. But I do recommend going inside and have a look. Now, second thing, you can choose to have this view over here, the mainland, but I highly recommend coming this other way. Tricky, can you please turn around? Jesus, thank you. I do recommend this view over here because you have a, a trash, no, 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 I'm joking. Just because you have this beautiful, majestic, beautiful view of the sea, and it's just breathtaking, it's just majestic, it's just incredible, it's just, oh, come on, you've got to shut up here. Bloody it's bloody amazing. Now let's, please follow me and come on this side and have a look, because really, the view just spans everywhere and what it does is, it's just, it's just simply amazing, like. And, and just, here, come here, just have a look at this small little frigging door. Like, who goes in there? Maybe you, Zdenka. I wouldn't be able to fit there.